great for in the university. Dear colleagues, it's my distinct honor to introduce to you now our guest speaker, Dr. Viola T. de los Reyes. Hello, Europeans. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, boss. Good morning, boss. So, first of all, I'd like to commend the organizers of this lecture forum on wellness. As far as I can remember, this is the first activity of this nature so far in the university. Congratulations to the Gender and Development Committee of the University, as well as the officers of the Philippine Association for University Women, TUD Chapter, for organizing this lecture for a long term program towards wellness for all of us here in TUP officials, administrative staff, faculty, and students. Our topic for today, I call it wellness, a choice that we can make. Wellness now, is an active process of becoming aware of and making choices toward a more successful dimension of wellness. Choosing our state of wellness. Choosing, pricing, and if you don't take care of yourself, the undertaker will overtake that responsibility for you. When it comes to eating and exercising, there is no, there is no I'll start tomorrow. Because tomorrow is medicine. So many people spend their health gaining wealth and then have to spend their wealth to regain their wealth. People spend a lifetime destroying their health only to their willingness to spend everything later on to regain. Thanks God, I don't have any maintenance medicines yet. I only take vitamin C and vitamin D. Testingin na natin. Pamigay mo na yung mga papel. Tinatawag na death calculator. Or it can be called a lifespan expectancy count. Morbid ba? Morbid. And research methodology from the University of Michigan. Actually, this instrument consists of 50 questions. But this was simplified by Dr. Willie Ong in the Philippines since some of the questions are not applicable to us Filipinos. Kaya, madali lang ito. You are in for a trip. According to Dr. Demko, yung pinanggalingan nitong article na to, everybody's got 79 years to start with. Yun ang global age. The global age now is 79. But because of the Philippines, the average lifespan of the Filipino is 70. It is heredity and family. Number one is gender. If you're a female, kung ano yung pinagsimulan nyo, plus one. If you're a male, minus two. Nagawa nyo na ba? Do you have grandparents or parents age 85 and above? If your answer is yes, plus two. If none, Zero. Wala kang wala kang ilalita. Nakaka, can you follow? Okay, number three. In your family, is there any member na may obesity, may diabetes, may heart disease? Yung mas sinabi ko kanina, yung mga cardiovascular disease? Kung ang sabot ko ay yes, minus two na. Pag wala, wala pa rin. Zero. So, nandun sa kabila, kung no, zero. Next question. Do you have two daughters? Kapag ang sagot ay yes, plus two. If none, siguro ito na yung pinakamalaki. Plus three ba? Minalik mo? Daughters, plus three. Kapamali yung pinakawa ko. Plus three pala yung daughters kasi yung graduate, yun ang plus two. Oh, sige, ulit ha. Pinagal ang plus. Pag wala, susunod yun. Another point yan. Okay? Pag wala, sabi, graduate. In college. Hmm. Oh, pag, pag graduate ka, yun ang plus two. Pag hindi, no, zero. Nakangal ka. Bakit may yung lalaki? If you're a guy, minus two. 
Kasi ang mga lalaki, supposed to be patrid ng pamilya, hardworking, hindi ba yung hindi, hindi nagpapakita ng emosyon, tinatago yung ano, lungkot nila, unemotional sila, so they have short their lifespan. Yun ang sinasabi. Yung parents or grandparents na matanda na, ibig sabihin yung pamilya nyo, heredity, magaganda ang mga minanong mong Uh, ano ng health na build mo. Kaya may plus ka dyan. Yung daughters, bakit may plus ko yung daughters? Ay plus ko yung palang. Kasi ang mga anak na babae, makalaga sa kanilang mga magulang. Pwede pwede rin ko sa mga And, bakit meron tayong plus ko pag college graduate, nakapag-aral? Kasi, supposed to be, when you're more educated, You know how to take care of yourselves better because you are educated. Ah, meron ba kayo score dyan? Does your diet include fruits, fish, and vegetables? If yes, plus two. If no, minus three. Ah, nakakasunod ba kayo? Next! Are you on an on and off diet fad? Ibig sabihin, minsan di ka kumakain kasi kami. Next part, lifestyle. Do you smoke a pack of cigarettes daily? O, kung hindi naman daily, pwede mo rin timplahin yan. Kasi kung nakaka-obos ka ng isang pack. Lifestyle. Ay, healthy outlook. Ah, parang yung mental, ano to, last. Makukwenta nyo na kung ilan nga yun yung ano. Current life expectancy. Do you own a pet? A dog? Please give her another round of applause.